Good morning, everybody. We don't have much of a plan for today. We've got some errands to run, but Gabriel's getting a little fussy in the house. So I decided to take him for a walk. It's not too terribly hot right now, but I've got a fan. I don't know if he can actually feel that, but there's nowhere to clip it for without him grabbing onto it. So we're going for a walk. You excited, buddy? <laughs> I tried to put his hat on him but he just kept ripping it off and trying to eat it, so we don't match. Anyway. Are you cute? What's his leg doing? <laughs> You're next. So we're all cleaned up, about to start our next errand. Hey. Of course, we have to get some lunch. He's loaded up, ready to go. We have to get lunch because we still haven't gone grocery shopping. That's another on the to-do list. That may happen today or tomorrow. Uh -huh. So we're all clean and pretty. I don't, can't tell what I'm filming because mm -hmm. I've got the viewfinder flipped around. So we're on the way. Now we're ready to go on our way. We're currently shopping for baby clothes and I've been fed, which is why I'm able to handle it. There are so many cute things here. Wish we had all the money in the world to buy everything. This is the cutest thing though. Hey. Hey. Ooh, somebody has a dirty diaper, I think. I think he wants that shirt. I don't like it. He doesn't Sorry. get to have it. Sorry, bud. Well, uh, we had a little change of plans. Sarah thinks she may have bit off of more than she could chew this morning. Between all the walking and backpack carrying and stuff from last week and the weekend, um, and then going for the walk today, and then she vacuumed. She Her back is hurting her really bad, so we left the mall came back home so she could lay down on the heating pad for a little while. Uh, we fed the, the little man and uh, the, the idea was hopefully he'd take a nap and I've got to go back out and I'm, we're looking for pants. Uh, I need a specific color pair of pants for some photos we're going to do. But um, the, I'm going back out to look for them. She's down on the heating pad. He didn't fall asleep. So he's gonna tag along with me. Hopefully he'll fall asleep in the car on the way to the store and then I'll wheel him around in his other stroller and he can uh, sleep while we're in the store. So hopefully we find what we're looking for and Sarah starts feeling better because weekends when she's down like that are kind of boring. They're not much fun at all. It's been, I guess, an hour and a half, maybe two hours since I left the house. Didn't do a lot of filming in the stores because I was actually looking for something and needed to find it which required some focus anyway i did not find it today was a bust um a little discouraged but we may depending on how sarah feels we may go back out tomorrow to um some actual malls like uh and try to and try to like look at, at, at JC Penney's or you know Dillard's something like that instead of um, Old Navy Gap we did that stuff today didn't work out Gabriel's been tagging along with me and I gotta be honest it no matter how discouraging it was to not find what I was looking for it was a, an absolute joy having him there and I really like pushing him up and down the aisles and then looking down at him and he's doing some weird thing with his mouth making some noise like you can hear him in the background drooling all over the place playing with his toes I don't know any of those things they make me smile and uh, 
when I look at him, I forget whatever disappointment I might be experiencing at the time. So, anyway, it's about 6 o'clock, so hopefully Sarah's feeling a little bit better. We're going to go home and have some dinner. See what's going on next door at Susie's and have some dinner. So, here's hoping tomorrow is a little bit more successful. Don't put me in. Good morning, everybody. Sarah's back feels much better, but she's asked me not to put her in the video right now because she looks awful. <laughs> she just said, don't put me, I look awful. So, we're not going to put her. Appreciate that. She appreciates it. So, we got donuts, our usual Sunday morning breakfast, which, you know, to be honest, I don't know why they don't just auto-draft 10 bucks from our bank account on a weekly basis <laughs> and have the donuts ready. But, I got chocolate iced with Halloween sprinkles. Be Jacob is a five-year-old. Because I can. I'm a grown-up. <laughs> and you have the metabolism of a five-year-old. And you can eat that with no ill effects. So, hopefully, we find my pants today. Sarah's back's feeling better. So I'm going to drag her back out into the world so that around roughly four o'clock this afternoon, her back hurts again. <laughs> Shopping attempt number two. Number two. Gabriel just woke up from a nap. So we're hoping he'll be in a good mood. He's been a bit of a handful this weekend. <laughs> he got up every two hours last night. So that was fun. Bit nothing. He's been two handfuls. <laughs> two full handfuls. So. We're going to a mall to get the last of our items that we need. Hopefully they have them. And we're going to go grocery shopping because that's all we do. That and going to the chiropractor and going to the grocery store are probably all we do. Yay, adulting! So we came to a mall right by our house. And this mall is dying like two breaths away from <laughs> death. Like almost every single store on the top floor was closed. Like, when the zombie apocalypse hits, this is where we'll go, I'm pretty sure. But they had a store in the food, co food court called Sushi and Taco, so you can get two of your favorite foods in the same place. <laughs> well, we found some pants, but we're not sure if they are the right color. They're a green, they're a lighter shade of green than olive, which, if you need olive pants, you can get those anywhere in the world. If you need like a, kind of a, almost a um, emerald green, jewel tone, kind of a, a darker green, like a dark Kelly green, I don't know. It's if it's okay. any, you just, well, we found some green, so hopefully they'll work. But, I mean, they're good pants, and I'll wear them. We just gotta set them next to uh, the outfit, see if it works. Anyway. We're going to eat lunch now. So we don't shop, grocery shop on an empty tub. Yep, so we're gonna go eat, then go to the grocery store, and then hopefully be done. <gasps> yeah, so we're at La Madeline having lunch. And it turns out Gabriel is a fan of tomato basil soup. It's a giant spoon. It's a soup spoon. Not a baby feeding spoon, that's dang sure. Mm. You like it? Is that yummy? Is that yummy? <laughs> Tomato basil mm. soup. <laughs> Just me now, uh, Gabriel kind of was over it towards the end of our lunch and started to kind of get real upset so we brought him home Sarah's gonna give him gonna feed him and then put him down for a nap for a little while while I run a few more errands I've got to go out to uh, to Michael's and try to find something for a dessert I'm gonna make tonight and then do the grocery shop just kind of the basic stuff and then we're gonna look for some good uh, baby food with protein like chicken a uh, little bit later on after he's had his nap. So I'm headed to the grocery store, Michael's. 
the grocery store ended up being a pretty horrific experience. Either there's a holiday tomorrow or an apocalypse scheduled that I was not aware of because everybody in the DFW area was at that grocery store and that grocery store put all of the people that they were training on the cash registers. So, of course, it was absolute chaos. Anyway, I am doing some brownies with a little uh, Halloween twist. <laughs> And mommy is getting ready to blend up some beets for Gabriel's dinner. Are you making the blender noise? Alright, do it. Your turn. I'm warming up the, the candy so that I can smooth it out so that it's not so blobby. It's kind of working. Kind of. It's like you need a wider one. Yeah, I need something more. I can just kind of go right across and smooth them all out. And he's getting fussy because he's ready for his dinner. Okay, these are my Frankenstein brownies or Frankenstein's monster brownies. Brownies and the likeness, with the likeness of Frankenstein's monster. Anyway, I realized that I staged them nicely and everything. Took a picture for Instagram and forgot to shoot anything about it. So, you get them on the cardboard plates, the little paper plates. So anyway, those are our monster brownies. Okay, we're done. We're two very tired parents. Thankfully, he went down super easy. He had a nice warm bath and baby massage. Beets. Beets. He likes beets. He loves beets. So I'm hoping he'll sleep for a while and not wake up every two hours. Yeah. Four every four hours. Because I have to be hours. like a career woman tomorrow. So I need to be able to focus. Hey, I have to keep him alive. <laughs> Yes, I, have, you do. I got focus too. Let's not play that game. All right. I think I have beats on my forehead. I'm holding still. the camera okay. sideways. All right. Well, I'm we're being edgy, shot. <laughs> Grudge. <laughs> it's like Jason Bourne movies. Yeah. Get the Chemical Brothers up. <laughs> we're, we're running through a subway. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for watching. If you made it this far, thank you for making it this far. We appreciate it. If you want to see uh, more videos like this from us, <laughs> click subscribe. <laughs> subscribe to our channel. We hit 100 subscribers. Actually, Yay! we surpassed 100 subscribers. Thank you all. Just the other day. That's pretty exciting. So we're well on our way to getting the uh, the gold play button Ooh. and uh, being able to live off of the money we make on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. So, uh, 50 cents. I'm going to make 50 cents next month. <laughs> Pretty excited about that. Uh, anyway, uh, if you liked it, give it a thumbs Sorry. up. Subscribe <laughs> to our channel. Click the bell so you get the notifications. And uh, leave us a comment about some of your favorite uh, treats, Halloween treats, and stuff like that. Give us some suggestions. Maybe I'll make them. I like to bake holiday treats. So, thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys later.